Normally, envy is not a good thing, but we make exceptions. Russell and Ronna Lee, Galbert truly live life to the fullest as family, friends, and business associates. Their achievement in both business and philanthropy are legendary. Russell is a real mensch. With his colossal achievements, he is blessed with true humility. Indeed, he inspires and uplifts those around him in his own special way. Russell and his partners are true Balitstaka on a global scale. But the crown jewel in this rich and varied crown is Kol El Chabad. Rana Lee stands by Russell and is equally involved in communal events in both Florida, New York, and Israel and staunch fighters against anti-Semitism. We are exceptionally proud to honor Russell and Ronna Lee with the Leadership by Example Award. That's nice. Leadership by Example Award presented to Russell and Ronna Lee Galbert, an inspiration to so very many to do the right thing always. Our fellow shareholders, thank you so much for this beautiful honor tonight. We are truly humbled by the crowd and the beautiful way that you have always welcomed Ronnelly and myself into this family, the Kolel Chabad family. Today our connection feels stronger and this family stands stronger, resilient as ever in its pursuit of Yiddishkeit and tzedakah. I must first and foremost give thanks to my special wife, Ronnelly, who is the glue that holds our family together. She keeps me and our girls united in love of our Jewish heritage and connected to our Jewish community in every way. She is a true Aishas Chayel and the real person who is solely deserving of this evening's award. For those of you who don't know my upbringing, I was fortunate to have been born of parents that have always stood and have always taught Jewish values. My father, Captain Hyman P. Galbert of a Shalom, and his co-captain, my mother, Bessie Galbert. I was blessed to be raised by a father who served in the United States Navy, a captain who spent time in the Pacific Theater, and a mother who taught by word and example to my three brothers and myself the true meaning of tzedakah and contribution to humanity. My parents and my brothers are as much responsible for getting me started on the right road to the Jewish values and the love of Torah. They share in this award tonight as well. It was 48 years ago when as a young man, when a young man brought me first to visit the Rebbe. That young man is here tonight, and he is, of course, our Colonel Yaakov Goldstein, who achieved fame in his own right as a United States military chaplain. Colonel Goldstein got it right then, and has always gotten it right throughout life. He sacrificed his time for the benefit of all humanity. I remember clearly the first encounter with the Rebbe. I was only 12 years old, yet I understood immediately that I was in the presence of a man of a totally different order, someone who personified spirituality and more power and capability that was beyond anyone's ordinary comprehension. In the Rebbe's eyes, I saw a love so, pro so profound and so full the impression is as vivid with me today as it was then. And I must also mention Rabbi Shalom Duchman, a man I have the greatest respect for, and a man we would not be all sitting here tonight without. Shalom Duchman. <laughs> Shalom Duchman is the epitome of kindness and love, a man who would walk through fire and brimstone to fulfill the mission entrusted to him by our Lubavitcher Rebbe. The Rebbe stood for truth, for love of one's fellow Jew, and for the love of all mankind, 
for every single man, woman, and child, whether color, whatever color, whatever religion, however humble, however poor, however simple, every person was precious to our Rebbe. And Kol Chabad was one of the most important charities to our Rebbe. Kol Chabad shows compassion and respect for the downtrodden, the humble, those who may seem unimportant. It is no, con no coincidence that the Rebbe made a contribution to Kol Chabad every single day of his life. And it is this because tzedakah is not phil philanthropy. Too often philanthropy and glamour go hand in hand. Tzedakah rather means justice, the right thing to do. And that is what Lubavitch and, Chobel, and Cholel Chabad are all about. From both myself, Ronaldy, and myself, we thank you again for this great honor, and may Hashem's blessings go with you all here tonight. Thank you.